everyone i am srisha this is your first lesson in grade 2 science today's chapter is things around us before we start our topic shall i recall your new words natural things n a t u r a l natural t h i n g s things natural things n a t u r a l natural t h i n g s things natural things m a n man m a d e made t h i n g s things man made things m a n man m a d e made t h i n g s things man made things l i v i n g living t h i n g s things living things l i v i n g living t h i n g s things living things n o n non l i v i n g living t h i n g s things non living things n o n non l i v i n g living t h i n g s things non living things now we are going to take a recap about your previous topic what did you learn in your last class shall i tell you natural things and man made things am i correct children first we are going to see about natural things the things that are created by nature is called as natural things for example sun moon stars rain rainbow water land plants animals human these all are created by nature so we can tell as natural things next we are going to see about man made things the things that are made by humans are known as man made things for example house car road building table chair book these all are made by human so we can tell as man made things i hope that you understand the topic correct children now we are going to see your today's topic is living things living things are breathe move on their own need food feel grow reproduce and have senses most living things need food water light temperature within defined limits and oxygen a flower and tree also living things plants are living things and they need air nutrients water and sunlight other living things are animals and they need food water space and shelter here look at the picture below you can see different things such as a boy soil mountains tree animals and a bird right children animals trees bird boy and fish are living things am i correct children mountain soil and air are non living things let us find out why look at each of the pictures given below these are some activities that living things can do living things move on their own living things breathe living things eat food living things produce babies living things grow living things also have feelings humans are living beings we laugh when we are happy we cry when we are sad or we feel pain am i correct children 
Now we know things that grow, move, eat, react are called living things. Animals, birds, fishes, insects and trees are all living things. A plant cannot love but it can feel. Have you ever tried to touch the leaves of a touch me not plant? If you touch some leaves, they fold inwards. This shows that they can feel. Just like human beings and animals, plants also grow. I hope that you understand our today's topic. Now I have a plan to give you few questions for recollect our topic. Refer your concept book in the page number of 13 and 14 and answer the following questions in the note. Shall I tell your first question? Your first question is, which of the following is a natural thing? Which of the following is a natural thing? Your options are, A. Telephone B. Rock C. Aeroplane D. Car Your options are, again I am telling, A. Telephone B. Rock C. Aeroplane D. Car Your second question is, Plants or dash? Plants or dash? Your third question is, what is mean by living things? What is mean by living things? Now we are going to learn few new words for reading practice which are given below. Shall we? A-I-R-A A-I-R-A B-I-R-D bird B-I-R-D bird M-O-U-N-T-A-I-N mountain M O U N T A I N mountain D E E R D D E E R D R A B B I T rabbit R A B B I T rabbit S O I L soil S O I L soil B O Y boy B O Y boy F I S K H fish F I S K H fish P L A N T S plants P L A N T S plants A N I M A L S animals A N I M A L S animals H U M A N human H U M A N human I hope that you all enjoyed our today's class I'll see you in my next class thank you